How I Met Your Mother. Ever seen it? <laughs> First and foremost, uh, all these characters are alcoholics. Well, we take that back. We can't say that because um, on a spiritual level, we can't call them alcoholics because that's something that somebody has to embrace on their own. However, comma, on a clinical textbook edition type deal, hitting happy hour like every day, every day, alcoholics. Now, the thing is that in people's minds, in people's minds, because of the way they broadcast and they shape these things by just throwing words around, you think that the people standing in front of the liquor store begging for change so they can go get their fix, that those people are lesser than you all hitting happy hour every day. And we're not judging because, see, it's kind of like racist. Just because you don't have a little white sheet on a pointy head, you don't use the N-word, but you sit there and you side with the colonizers, you're still just as racist as a racist just because it's binary. It's either on or off. And then the second thing is, is the whole thing about the one chick that goes back and forth between the couple of friends, that's weird to us. Because since high school, we won't even like have sex with the jump off because the first time we saw a dude get with the jump off and fall in love with her, we just steer clear of them. Well, best we can, so. R-E-X.